Okay, I like fully installed the game. So hopefully there won't be any problems. All the same, it feels like that's not the issue here. Maybe it's blue stacks? I don't know. I really don't want to switch from a different switch to a different emulator because I can't really think of a better emulator at the moment. It's like a emulator. It's like there's a specific emulator for each game. Like that works better. Uh-oh. Oh no, it's a Moritaka. Oh no, Moritaka. Oh no. They stole Moritaka's sword. I told you to address me as shit out. But, but uh, please forgive my lack of manners, Shino. What brings you to this place? Perhaps I, perhaps you have come so that I may finally train under you. Quite the contrary, Philly. Quite the contrary, Philly, L1. As of now, your discipline is of no use to you. You may put aside your bamboo sword at once. C come again? I don't have a Moritaka voice. Did I stutter? Phil one you will stop your training at once! Get out of here! Wait, wait, wait a moment, Shino! Why must I part with my sword? Loyal one here tells me that you've been noticeably dejected as of late. I am embarrassed to admit that that is true. Which is more, which is more reason for me to train ever harder. I, I need to come up with a Moritaka voice. <laughs> <clears throat> I have sworn to one day I have sworn to one day become a great warrior. The sword is my life. There is no way for me to live without it. I must one day make a name for myself as an outstanding samurai. <laughs> How you wish to <laughs> infuse the sobriety of a warrior? Relax your brow. Do you know what do you know what happens to horses that can no longer run? Once you have served your purpose, you are disposed of on the spot. D do you know what you're saying? You intend to denigrate the warriors of the land of the land of Wong with those words? I speak the truth. Don't you know how many aspiring warriors simply vanished into the shadows of history that way? No, I don't believe it. There's no way they would be treated in such a vile manner. If only you knew how brainwashed you really are. You remind me of someone. How am I to serve? Is what I feel a truly a sense of fealty? Are those not the doubts that have been distracting you? Why would I be intimidated by the howlings of a pup who fails to care even for himself? You fail to see that you've entangled your desp your disparate doubts together, you fool! Do it, loyal one. Ah! N no, loyal one, stop! <laughs> Why are you so frightened? We only wish to show you a training facility that may suit your needs. <laughs> there is such interesting events here in Tokyo, no? Loyal one, put him in the box. Gladly. Wait, what? 
they just didn't want. I heard an event just right for you is being held soon. It'll be good for you to re reconnect with your feral sign. Father! I, I, I mean, she... I, I, father, I mean, she know. Don't you think that might have been a little excessive? There's no need to worry. I've only put him to sleep for the time being. I trust you can send him to the correct location. <laughs> what? Package content, sleeping puppy. That shouldn't be a problem, right? <laughs> It's a Mori Taka episode. N not that it, not that I mean that in a bad way. It's that Mori Taka is very emotional for what I say. Ah! Ah! <laughs> what a fine day to be! What a fine day to be in the mountains. Mori Taka, Mori Taka, everyone's looking for you. Oh, is that so? I'll hit back right now. Ah, there you are. You tailed off. Here. There are so many of you, it takes forever to dry you after a bath. Thank you for helping with the devils, everyone. Now we can make it in time for the afternoon activities. They did so well in the battle earlier, it's the least we can do. It must be such a chore at bath time with so many to care for. Bathing at my dojo with all its members is also a hassle. Yeah, it's almost time for the daily thing at the dorms. It's almost, it's almost a daily thing at the dorms. So we're used to it, but no. <laughs> all right, looks like we're all finished, nice and clean now, aren't we, Devils? Okay, form a nice line. Each Devil gets one juice box. So behave. Oh, Eisen, you don't have to do that. I hope they're not inconveniencing you. Don't worry, I was about to have something to drink myself. Plus, I brought extras to share. Hmm? <laughs> what a lively camp this is. This place is starting to feel like a nursery. Kim and Kamui, welcome back. And right on time. We just finished driving, trying off the devils. Hmm. Are they replacing Maria? I was told a different staff member is taking a shift to join our team. <sighs> Clearly, they still want to keep a close eye on Kim and Kamui in case he transforms again. I brought back our food and supplies for lunch. Let's find a nice place to enjoy our meal. Pretty early in the day. Oh wow, it's only just around noon. Must have arrived earlier than I thought. We did leave the first checkpoint quite early in the morning. Most of the other teams have arrived here already as well. You know, had we been on schedule like the other teams, we'd have been finishing up lunch by now. I have no rebuttal. Hold it with both your hold it with both your hands or else you'll drop it, Kagatsuchi. Whoa! This rice ball is huge! It's a little cold, but it's nice and fluffy! We have some hot and steamy instant miso soup. It says here freeze dried Mmm, but it's good! <laughs> you just have to have hot or cold water and it's ready to eat in seconds! It's great, isn't it? No, huh? This is like what Choji brought for us. <sighs> That's right. Choji mentioned he had eaten with you a few days ago. Looks like we have many different flavors of biscuits, too. Now, Devils, make sure you chew your food. There's so many options, it's hard to choose what to eat first. The advances made in food preservation methods are amazing. 
I hear Tokyo had impressive food preservation methods even before the different worlds and their cultures were introduced. The amount of growth this city has experienced is just astounding. It's much different from the immutable world that is my home. The immutable world? What does that even mean? You mean Kamui Kotan? Yes. It now seems so long ago since I was summoned here to Tokyo. Hmm. My homeland, Kamui Kotan, is a frozen world completely co covered in ice and snow. The snow never ceases to fall. The cold c would make you think time was itself was frozen. To succumb to the cold is to welcome certain death, and your every moment is a struggle for sustenance. Each person must respect the boundaries of their domain. To cross those lines is impermissible under the laws of that harsh world. Hmm. Hmm. However, even under those intense pressures, people have survived, passing their knowledge to each subsequent generation. I have been sent from the heavens to bestow blessing upon those very people. And so, bears came to be the object of worship by those people. However, be it a person or bear, the law for respecting one's domain and the punishment for leaving said domain still applies. There is no forgiveness for those who forsake the laws of nature. Bears, capable of being both giver of blessings or vicious violators, are subject to these laws just the same. Are we talking about Wen Conway? In my land, the word Wen carries the meaning of evil, or all things at first. A bear known to have attacked people is regarded as a Wen Conway and is therefore shunned. The task of hunting down this bear is given to the people's young. A bear turned when Kamui is forbidden from all things, including giving themselves as nour nourishment for the people. They are simply banished. People who have done wrong are taken by the bears, and bears who have done wrong are hunted by the people. That is the never-ending chain of burdens which governs my homeland. Kevin Conway. Mm. Do you dislike your home? <clears throat> that is a difficult question to answer. Such thoughts never such thoughts never crossed my mind when living there. I wholeheartedly believed that the ways of the world were how everyone wished for it to be. Be, but as the culmination of all things that made up that world, was it really a good system? Now that I can look back at it with more, with a more holistic perspective from a distance, there is much to feel somber reservation over. It is interesting how one thinks so much of their home only when far from it. Uh. My apologies, it seems I have dampened the mood. No, we're the ones who asked you first. We apologize if it was a difficult topic for you. If I may take the opportunity to change the topic. Shiro, what is on the itinerary for this evening? Oh, right. Let's see, today's evening plans are... Non-existent! Huh? Ah! Non-existent! Well, hold on. There is an explanation. This checkpoint is surrounded by the forest with a river nearby, and a checkpoint replete with nature. Today we're supposed to enjoy said nature. You can challenge the athletic course or simply take in the fresh air while exploring. I'm not picking on Moritaka! Nope, but, like, do not make me pick on Moritaka! 
I'm, uh, hey, you, you can make it too easy to tease him. That is a precious boy. So we can choose what we want to do. If you're up for it, we can even change into our swimwear and go splashing or go splash around in the river. Hmm. Hey, let's go cliff diving, Moritaka. Why? Why are you singling me out? I will not go cliff diving just because the weather is hot. <laughs> there is all sorts of equipment for rent at the main tent. Go take a look, and I'm sure you'll find something of interest. May I confirm one thing with you? I noticed the itinerary did not list when we were supposed to start preparing dinner tonight. There's no need to worry on that end. The staff members will be taking care of that. The staff will? Does that mean you will be cooking for us? Yes. Many of us have already been given our cooking materials. We can begin cooking whenever we have time. I'm going to prepare my specialty, so you should prepare to be amazed! <laughs> All right, let's make the best of this time. Is everyone, is everybody ready? Boom, chicka, boom. Uh, boom, boom, chicka, boom. It's still not catching on. It's not gonna catch on ever. So we can really do whatever we want? If so, I wanna go somewhere with a good view. I will go observe the activity of the other teams. It is my duty to maintain order wherever I am. Besides, I should observe and understand as much as I can of the missionary's activities as an envoy to Tycoon. Hmm. I wonder what I should do. What will the rest of you do? Would anybody want to come exploring with me? I heard the main tent is also renting out coffee makers. I'd like to sit down and take it easy with a cup of coffee and read a book. In that case, can the devils come exploring with me? That sounds fine by me. Just make sure not to go wandering too far out of my sight. Nice! Let's go, Devils! Follow me! Wait, can't you track anybody... Can't you track anybody that's in range of your Devils? Charge! Slow down before you trip over something, and don't go anywhere that looks dangerous! <laughs> Considering what we've been through so far, they should be able to take care of themselves just fine. Besides, there are other staff members from the missionaries on the lookout. They truly have gone through much personal growth. If there's anyone I'm concerned about, it would only be... Hmm? Huh? Uh, Mori, you're spacing out there. Well, we, well, we've been told to go enjoy ourselves, but it's just that I don't know how. I've been there. I mean, up to this point, I simply followed the guidance and directions given by Kim and Conway and Shiro, but now that I've been given the freedom to do as I wish, training the exercise is all that comes to mind. I promised myself I enjoyed my time here with everyone, I just... Moritaka, why don't you come along with me? I have an idea for a training course to put you through. Uh, uh, a training course? Please, Kimikamui! I would be so very grateful! Hmm. I want to train with Moritaka, too! Uh, 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 please don't smile at me like that! You're making me feel... I, I can't believe I'm still so susceptible to your every little expression! I, I must train more diligently. Very well! <laughs> the two of you can follow me this way. Hmm. Hmm. My food should be here soon. I hate that I can't stop thinking about these characters. <laughs> oh no. No, it's Moritaka by himself? So did he actually, did they actually take my sword instead? 
Oh no. And oh my god, this coffee is super hot. Way too hot. Undrinkable right now. I forgot my Moritaka voice. It's actually been a couple days. Ha! Yes! Wait! No! What? Ah! <laughs> Are you okay, Moritaka? Do you think you can catch any fish with that form, Moritaka? Get back on your feet! <laughs> I understand! I'll hit my mark this time! <laughs> I'll hit my... Wait. Wait just a second. What am I doing? This isn't training! Moritaka, do you dare belittle your task? Even the humble fish you aim to capture is a facet of the great, far great Mother Nature. Do you not see the benefits of challenging a creature that endures to survives the wilderness? Uh, you may be right about survival. I prefer to train with a sword rather than improve my skill with a harpoon. When you said you put me through a training course, I imagined we'd be sparring. Is that not a famed sword that you hold at your belt? Surely the owner of such a weapon would have incredible skill. <sighs> I am sorry to disappoint you, but I do not wield this hunter's blade for the purpose of sparring. Hmm. The hunter's blade. And no small talk! Commit yourself to the challenge at hand! Catch at least one fish before you whinge over training methods! <laughs> He's so uncompromising. What does he remind me of? <laughs> you appear to be hard at work, young cub. Why do you look so down? Don't tell me you haven't even caught one fish. <laughs> That's exactly all right, Arzalan. <laughs> He's having some trouble with the task. Is there something bothering him? A sense of uncertainty is evident in his footwork. Hi, Arslan. Oh, young cop. <laughs> Isn't it a perfect day to enjoy the glory of Mother Nature? What brings me here? I'm simply making my rounds to check on the participants. I can't leave all the surveilling to Aizen alone. <laughs> Besides, I have a little a favor to ask of Kim and Kamui. We were thinking of serving fish tonight for tonight's dinner. There are many mouths to feed. You think you're up to the task? Absolutely. Moritake here is just about to catch us a large haul of fish. Ah! Whoa, 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 wait a second! How can you promise such a thing when I can't even catch one fish? How many do we need to catch? The park rangers have provided us with a few already. To be honest, we are just a bit short. I thought that some I thought that someone might miss out on their meal if I were to fail. Are you sure I'm right for this task? Don't worry, I'll help out too. Really? I must apologize. I did not mean to be so piteous. It's time I toughened up to fulfill my duty. <laughs> yes, that's the spirit. Now show me how it's done once more. Watch how I do this. This is how bears have caught fish since time immemorial. Ah! Impressive, Kim and Kabuli. 
We make a perfect team! <laughs> Thank you, Arthur. This is just one of many survival skills I've developed in my homeland. Such savage, such savage yet precise movements. He definitely reminds me of someone. So, what do you think of my fishing skills? Barely arms on my weakness. <laughs> <laughs> Moritaka, your desperate dog and avidity is causing the fish to flee. You desire strength too desperately. However, it is not strength that you need. You must have reverence for the blessing of nature. Reverence? We live off the lives of others. If we seek if we cease to take those lives, we will soon cease to live ourselves. This is true for my homeland, and it is true for Tokyo. It is a constant that applies to all, no matter which world you live in. Hmm. There are lives that will sustain our own. There are those who will cease to be before we do. It is through this that we may continue our own lives. That is why you must cast aside your doggedness and act with reverence. This is one of the doctrines that I preached in my homeland. Hmm. Well, something to think about. Ah. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah! 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 <sighs> His expression. He's found his concentration. As still as undisturbed water. As still as undisturbed water. I must calm my spirits. Allow myself to fill with the current. There! Ha! Now it's my turn. <laughs> Why the long face came in comely? Do those cubs give you something to think about, perhaps? Those who take the body of a living creature for their own sustenance will one day fall victim to that very same fate. In my homeland, I always believed that convention to be good and be good and true. A necessary constant cycle. And upon arriving here in Tokyo, where growth and change are permissible, I notice myself becoming increasingly selfish. More and more, I wish to lead those in need and undo the grips of their past that hold them back. It is not enough to give my body to be their sustenance. I want them to carry on practicing what I teach. Hmm, I feel the same. I've seen many different worlds coming before coming here. And when I look back at my own homeland, a similar thought comes to mind. There are things one cannot see when one is fixated on doing their best in the small confines of their own world. With a broadened perspective, one will come to understand the greater system and appreciate the sacrifices made to enable it. I want to provide them with such perspectives to guide them into the future, to a place they cannot reach alone. Thank you for s your sincerity, Arsene. Ah! Oh no, it's back again. What is? Oh no, again? 
<laughs> you forgot to mention me, Kim and Kamui. You and I are one and the same. There can be no Kim and Kamui without Win Kamui. He changed so fast. Be careful, Moritaka. Well now, it's time I carve out some growth. Are you ready to be cut down? Lynn Com Comley? This is not how I wanted to spar today. Hmm. You who reject the immutable and endeavor to attain personal growth. Shed your skin and become my puppet. Dualistic fate! Strength is the warrior's ultimate desire. I will continue to sharpen my blade as I cut my enemies down. I, Moritaka and Azuka, formally challenge you to a fight! It's a carbon copy of myself. No matter, I accept your challenge. I desire to spar with someone since I have arrived here. I'll defeat my past self and achieve that personal growth you so despise. They stole- okay, so they stole his sword. How dare you sully my name by brandishing such a silly little toy! Just wait one second, I would never intentionally do something so blatantly boorish! Don't waste your breath! Prepare yourself now! Moritaka, take this! not a sword, but you can use it! This harpoon? But I have absolutely no experience with pole weapons. <sighs> but I have no other choice. <laughs> my shadow. My past. I will bring you down! Come on, Moritaka, you can do it! Oh, be cool if I could get a special. ミスドの流れを踏まが魚を狙うがごとく。我が牙はその一点を奪つない。そこだ。もらった。手。捕まえた。ジタバタしてもダメでござる。楽しい。いえ、修行でござりますぞ。Okay, my coffee cult cooled down real quick. Wait, we're joined by a... Alright. Moritaka, Sienu, and Azuka be best by one who can barely wield their weapon! Hmm. 
Is that the worst you can do? You are no match for my blade harpoon. <laughs> He's doing real work with that harpoon. I understand now. Single mind of doggedness makes attacks easy to read. Even I, wielding an, wielding an unfamiliar weapon, can fend off his attacks with ease. What a fool I was. No wonder Shino could not resist offering me some exhortations. I suppose that there are things that can only be seen after taking a few steps back. This isn't looking too good. I'm going to have to step in again. Another surprise attack? You fiend! A bear must hunt and be hunted in an endless cycle of an, of an immutable world enclosed. From within that eternal cycle, I will bring forth a multitude of past. What? It is impossible to affect an individual who will rule more than once unless he's carving out something different. I will show you the true ferocity of Kamui Kotan! Dualistic fate! What's he doing now? Uh oh! Uh, uh, <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Oh. Uh, uh, what's happening? Uh, uh, wait, I recognize the. Uh, wait, another puppet? Is this a different Moritaka? Wait, I recognize that look. Uh, I've kept it a secret for so very long! My feelings, my desire! What, what is he doing? I can no longer ignore that which is screaming inside me! There's something very important that I must ask of you, Brendan! Oh no, not again! <laughs> you want me to be your lover? I've always adored you, Brandon! <laughs> ah! that, that's, not, that's not true! I mean, it's true, but it's still a secret! That's right, don't listen to that new one! He's on this split! He's been crude, and I would never admit in hearts like that! <laughs> I have always, always adored you, Brandon! Oh, God. Stop! We would do anything if you would just please stop talking! <laughs> Whatever is happening here is sure of... <laughs> Whatever is happening here sure is effective. His sacred artifact is a force to be reckoned with. He's made a mess of my person, my heart, and my clothes! How about we get, begin round two already? Oh, but you're outnumbered now, aren't you? Don't worry. I'll lend the hand. <laughs> I'll help you through this, Moritaka. I would be most thankful, Brandon. <laughs> We're still outnumbered two or three. You worry on those. We had just one more person. Uh. <laughs> This might sound weird coming from a passerby like me, but would you mind if I joined your ranks? That voice sounds familiar. <coughs> it's fire element too. I'm not sure I'm not sure who you are, but your help would be much appreciated. Right? <coughs> I think I know who that is. Right? <laughs> right? Right? Is that not one of mine? Could it be a traitor? Now it's three on three. Let's overcome this trial together. Here I come. Um, I think I know who that is. Now that I think about it. You ain't slick, Tata Tomo. Mizutsu 
満たされてござります。さあさあ逃がしはいたしませぬぞ。おいミスの流れをいつしか。Yeah, that's Tana Tomo. Because <laughs> that's Tana Tomo's. That, that was Tana Tomo's ability kicking in. クマが魚を狙うがごとく我が牙はその一点をうがつなりそこだもらったってもらってんだどうやもらってんだそこbecause <laughs> Tadatomo Tadatomo has an ability to inflict burn on all those on pretty much any enemy in his attack radius Feelings have been causing me to suffer for some time, but now that they've been revealed, I found clarity. I thank you for giving me this very educational trial. That was one for the books. I should be thanking you as well. I should be thanking you as well, Brandon. I don't have a more you talk of voice. I can't, I can't decide as to how to go about it. It seems as though the cub has found an answer to his troubles. Now it's time we all cover we uncover your ulterior motives, Wink Conway. Ulterior motives. <laughs> I have no ulterior motives. This is simply how the system is. Kim and Kamui endeavors to foster personal growth, and I must act to cut that growth down. Hmm. This is how, at some point, Kim and Kamui and I are destined to encounter the him hero at Kamui Kotan. Kim and Kamui will offer that hero his fur, among other blessings, while I. <laughs> Next time, we'll have fun on my own terms. <laughs> oh. 
Orson, what has happened? Moritaka, Brandon! <sighs> Worry not, Kim and Kamui. The cub was able to achieve his personal growth. You may rest. I want, <clears throat> I, I want to thank you for your assistance, especially you, Ngoyo Hwan. So, <laughs> so you've seen through my disguise. It seems I've underestimated you, Phil I One. Yep, Taratomo. I knew it was you. <laughs> I should have expected as much. Just like my father, nothing can get past the likes of you, my lord. <clears throat> Phil I all one, now that I've witnessed your breakthrough, your chains of doubt, I can return that which you've certainly missed. Oh, so he stole the sword. Okay. So it was you who stole my sword? I was simply following Shino's orders. Perhaps you could say I was fulfilling a request. <clears throat> I believe that he's going to make the same mistake I made some time ago. Warriors who've done nothing but prove their heroism on the battlefield are abandoned once they've served their purpose. It is possible that his lord will not desire such a thing, but that will undoubtedly spell disaster for his master. I don't want him to meet the same fate I did. He must find a way to open his eyes. Loyal one, do you know of any place that may help ease one's mind? <clears throat> to ease one's mind? Why not the Scout Jamboree? <laughs> yeah, let's try, let me try and go for a Shadow of the Hedgehog voice. I have some connection with those who operate the event. <laughs> let's give it a try. While we're at it, we should remove his blade from him. The pup sure needs a lot of looking after. So this was all planned out from the very beginning. <laughs> well, well, except for this whole Win Conway situation. But all's well that ends well. Here, have some sweets for your troubles. With that said and done, I must bid you all farewell for now. There you are! How's it going, you two? Maria said Arslan told told her you'd be here. You've been catching fish, right? Oh, I'm so excited! How many have you caught? Oh! oh. We totally forgot. Still plenty of fish. Does anybody want seconds? <sighs> oh, wow! I must have died and gone to heaven. This fish is amazing. And they're salt and they're salted perfectly to bring out their natural wild flavor. Master Kenley Kami's cooking is really good too. <laughs> I'm glad you enjoy my specialty. I believe it's known as jib jibier in this world. Jibier? Meat from wild game. It's used to be the backbone of the nobility's coarse meals. It's super juicy and tender! This is what Kingo was talking about the other day, right? He's really missing out. <laughs> we must take advantage of the provisions that the land has given us. Making sure to consume everything down to the animal's blood itself. Well, I'm not sure about the blood part, but alright. <clears throat> we must allow nothing to go to waste so that we may appreciate the entire the, uh, the life that was sacrificed. I see. Now I understand. And remember, by letting nothing go to waste, we avoid polluting the land. 
we must also never forget to offer gratitude. We must keep in mind and recognize that in order to survive, we must commit the sin of taking another's life. Hmm. That still makes me uncomfortable. <laughs> if we don't eat, we can't live. We must always remember to give thanks. I give my thanks to this meat and this fish. Let's be sure to appreciate and eat every little bit that's on our plate. Well, I usually do anyway. <laughs> you needn't stress over it every meal. But just keep in mind how important it is to give thanks for what supports our survival. Hmm. Hmm. Shiro, why do you look so nervous? There, that's it. Now bring up your plate so he can see. What? Who are you talking to? Who's thanks? Oh, hello, devils! <laughs> Here's here for seconds, are we? There's plenty enough to go around. Are you sure you can carry it? Oh. <laughs> oh, that's cute. Hmm. Moritaka, you should allow someone else to take over the fire for a moment. I prepared the hot tub. Go and relax. <sighs> Thank you so much, Aizen. I'll go take a little dip right now. <laughs> take your time and don't hesitate to call if you need anything. I won't be far. Do you mind if I join you? I could use a break after dressing the game. Am I joining too? <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> All three choices is just like. Mm. <laughs> Although compared to what I've seen in the latest releases of beach outfit uh summer beach outfits <sighs> life wonders y'all really y'all really push it <laughs> you look good in a yukata i feel honored to receive your compliment my other clothes got ruined in that encounter I'm glad the loyal one left it for me to use, but he seems to have acquired one size too small. So will you two join me? What a pleasant surprise. I'm glad I won't be alone. What's this? I hear a familiar voice coming from the tub. Can't eat any more curry. <clears throat> Arlen, you shouldn't fall asleep in there. <clears throat> What's that? Oh, it's just so comfortable. <clears throat> oh no, did I fall asleep? The warmth must have made me doze off. It's important to maintain your hydration if you are to bathe for a long period of time. I have some water here on hand. Two of you go ahead and get in the tub before me. <laughs> oh. Did not expect to see <laughs> bath suit Ars bathing suit Arslan. <laughs> ah, I feel alive again. You saved me there, Kim and Kamui. Now, if I may say, you've done good work today, young cubs. I can see that you've grown through these efforts. Remember the road you seek to follow is yours alone. But it's also not unwise to put into practice what you have learned from the from others. I understand. <sighs> Again, 
Is that love I'm witnessing? The love that a warrior has for their lord? Or is it... <laughs> and earlier, I saw it with my third eye. The love that Tata Tomo expressed through his loyalty. Then, if my assumptions are correct, the love of Win Kamui is... Hmm. Wonder what that new resolution is. <laughs> 